brought to you by... What's up friends, Ollie here, back with an all new ETF review. Today, I'm fucking miserable, because I watched and now have to discuss playing with dolls, or Metal Face for those who watched it on Amazon Prime. This film follows Cindy who just lost her job and her home. She's desperate for money and a place to live, so she hastily accepts a job offer, only to find out that her new employer is a sadistic billionaire who gets his kicks off of unleashing a ruthless killer named Metal Face on them. Upon first impressions here, writer director Rene Perez is either completely talentless, very careless, or simply doesn't care about the product that he's putting out. This film begins very abruptly by introducing an extremely loose premise, far later than it should have I might add, one that I had to strain to keep my attention focused on, and ends just as abruptly without any real explanations for anything. The film has a decent look to it, mostly stemming from the color grading choice. It's not completely visually unappealing, however the story is extremely lackluster and highly underdeveloped. The gore effects are not as abundant as I hoped, and are pretty cheap. The cast bands together to form a cacophony of piss poor performances by a handful of absolutely talentless individuals who do nothing to stand out among the masses. These guys take over acting to a whole new level. If this is the quality of film that Perez was going for, he only succeeds in proving that anyone devoid of talent can turn a profit by producing low-grade films with no substance. I'm giving Playing With Dolls an F. Friends, I went into this really hoping I would enjoy it, even if it wasn't the best of quality, but there's nothing of merit here. If you still want to check this out, it's available on Amazon Prime, or it was the last I checked, but I personally wouldn't waste my time. I'll never get that hour and 20 minutes back. Today's episode of ETF has been brought to you by Curiosity Stream. Curiosity Stream is the world's first streaming service dedicated to curating and delivering thousands of the best documentaries from around the globe to be watched ad free, on demand, anytime anywhere. Stream it to your Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Chromecast, Apple TV, your desktop, tablet, or iOS and Android phones, all starting at an affordable $2.99 a month, or annually just $11.99 a year, with your first seven days completely free. With a deal that good, why not expand your horizons today with Curiosity Stream? But that's all for today, friends. If you are enjoying the content so far and want to help us keep bringing new types of videos for you to enjoy, please consider supporting ETF on Patreon, where every pledge goes right back into the channel to help us with upgrading equipment, maintaining our software, and checking out new flicks to discuss here. If you want to see more videos like these, feel free to let us know down below or give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you all next time. Thanks for watching.